I've been spending time at places like Orange Elementary School and other schools where I'm actually meeting and working with your children, right? The children of this community, the children of, of, of these very different cities and, and towns, if you will. And it's been very important work. You know, a, a symphony orchestra, um, your symphony orchestra is a guiding light. It's a guiding spirit um, surrounded and supported by advocates and ambassadors, if you will, by the teachers in these schools. And I'm just so amazed and humble by what I've seen and what I am seeing um, in terms of their education, their edification, and the promise um, that these types of concerts and experiences really do literally bring into the classroom. And it's a good reminder of the relevancy of any arts organization, but in, but in this instance, the relevancy of this particular orchestral organization led by uh, Maestro Weinberger is that they care. It wasn't just me in those schools, it was uh, musicians like Nathan on trumpet, Casey on trombone, Matt on percussion, Robert on violin and flute and saxophone and clarinet. You know, the musicians from these orchestras, we went into that school together, um, led by a woman named Kathleen, who is a wonderful uh, violist in the orchestra and is also the librarian and is also one of the administrators. And this is where we are, I think, right now. I can assure you as a board member for uh, the APAP National Conference, a board member for Creative Capital, and as somebody who's working with the League of American Orchestras, I can assure you that what is happening in our country in terms of the orchestral experience in some ways is dire. But this place, Cedar Falls, this place, Waterloo, you need to know that you're doing something very special here. And these concerts represent the kind of culminating activity of when musicians and artists who care, musicians who, and artists who are committed not only to their own career, but to their, but to their communities, draw that beautiful line and say, come into our home now and let us make this a good, entertaining, and important time for us all. So I just wanted to say how inspiring it is for me from New York City, right, quote unquote, to come here and be reminded of, well, you know, the center of the earth, the center of the planet is wherever you decide it to be. And for me right now, it's Waterloo and Cedar Falls.